the Fitbit Charge tracks sleep automatically based on movement or lack of movement. Being a person that rolls around in bed quite frequently, I was quite skeptical about how accurate it would be. However, just in my tests uh, with it in normal mode, I found that it tracks sleep generally to within plus or minus 10 minutes. I'll, I'll take you through uh, my recorded sleep for the past three evenings. Last night, I, I did go to bed at 2200. It has me recorded as sleeping from 2206, which is probably reasonably accurate as I'm a person that falls asleep quite easily. It has me been awake from about 4.50. I know I, I woke up about 4.45. So again, that's within a 10 minutes. If I go back. Now the previous evening, I was woken up by my son during the middle of the night and I went and sat with him for a short period. So and it does have me to record, or has that recorded as me being awake. So there's two separate sleep times. So one small sleep session of two hours, 19 minutes. And a larger sleep time of four hours and 35 minutes after I went back to bed. However, the night before Monday night, um, again, my son woke up in the middle of the night and I did again get out of bed and, and go and sit with him for a short period, roughly for about 30 minutes again. However, it has my sleep recorded as sleeping through it. Well, it has a small recording of me being awake so restless, restless. So it has me record as me awake for six minutes. However, I know I was actually awake for about half an hour. So that evening, it, perhaps maybe because I wasn't uh, moving much, it didn't record me as being awake. In general, I think uh, the algorithm which Fitbit uses to detect sleep seems to be reasonably accurate, at least generally for the times when I first did go to sleep and when I do get up in the morning, it's within 10 minutes.